Howdy, everybody. Welcome to the Dice Tower. My name is Tom Vassell. I am Mike Delisio. Hello. And I'm Roy Canaday. <laughs> All righty. Well, welcome Tuesday. It is November 3rd, I believe. Actually, this is kind of a hard date for, to forget. Yes. November 3rd. And we are playing through a game called Penny Dread Fun. Now, this is a prototype game. It's on Kickstarter now. You can see a link in the description of our video. So realize that not everything is going to be the same as you see it here. And or even possibly rules may be not right or done wrongly by us. But we'll try to get it as right as we possibly can. <laughs> as always. We're playing through scenario one of the game. This is the prologue. It's a bit of a tutorial scenario. So we're going to be going through. Each of us is a specific character. I am Emily Dickinson. Or I think specifically, I am the ghost of Emily Dickinson. Ooh. What about you? I am Mary Curie, and I think, I think, I think I've got a jetpack. Actually, I think you are more specifically. <clears throat> um, you are Marie. You are Marie Skłodowska Curie. Well, sure. I'm glad we have that clarification. Skłodowska? <laughs> That's what it says here. You really got to get in the theme, Mike. I'm, I'm going to lean into the Skłodowska through this entire uh, game playthrough here. Listen, I'm Alice from Alice in Wonderland, but I have a baseball bat that I put nails into. <laughs> That's right. You got a. What's nail the name of your baseball bat? Uh, does it have a name? Is there a card with it specifically <laughs> no, for the name? That'd be so. awesome. Not, not Lucille. Somebody said that we look brighter this morning. That's right. We added more lights in the lights. studio. Yes, we are. Ooh. We are illuminated. So, all right. So this is a deck building game of sorts, and we each have our own starting deck. We all have eight of the same cards, and then two different cards. Uh, we build a map here, matching the scenario. So let me tell you what's going on here. Mm. In the evening, you hit the busy streets of London. Each of you, for your own reason but with certain conviction that no matter what, you'll all end up in your favorite pub and play darts with your buddy Harry. Harry Potter. Oh. No, I don't think it's Harry Potter. No, not Harry While Potter. reciting Wordsworth poems. Do you know that Harry is the second most popular name for a dog throughout the empire? Anyway, forget it. Because the entire planet has gone up in smoke. There are demons everywhere. <gasps> Peeing into flower pots. <laughs> really? Making oh. silly faces and oh. singing shanties. Mm -hmm. These don't sound as bad, no, actually. No, They're they more, sound more annoying. mischievous than anything else, yeah. Demonic hounds are running free, <laughs> making demonic poops. Demonic parrots are mocking the people. Sitting on lampposts. Wait, nope, nope, they're ravens. Sorry. Okay. Is that what it says? <laughs> yeah, I'm reading it. <laughs> Straight up. All right. Where are my glasses? Oh, here they are. <laughs> I'm reading this. Uh -huh. And look what's over there. What's a strange light? A portal. You take out a handy map of the district and decide you need to make a plan because everything starts with a good plan, a scientific experiment, an annexation of another state, revolution, an attempt on the life of the Russian Tsar. Well, a lot of things. Mm. Mm. So if anything I know, the person who wrote this, insane. <laughs> All right. So as we look here at the board itself of the game. So we set this up according to the scenario here. And we this is a map of London. We are all starting here in one spot. There are some bad demon dudes Ooh. that are floating around the board. They're going to be coming after us. And there is a mini boss that will show up at some point. What we need to do to beat this game is we need to seal the portals. There are four portals. Okay. There's actually a demonic portal there ah. at the bottom. Ah. That one we can't seal. That's where this guy is going to come out of. Uh -oh. All right. We need to seal the other ones. To seal them, we are going to be following this walk in a street card. So this walk in a street card says, uh, we decided to walk in the streets of London and investigate what's going on. You decide to follow. Okay, we're going down a pub thing. We need to put tokens on that card. Whenever we win a fight with an enemy of the crown, so a bad guy, uh -huh. <clears throat> or the mini boss, We'll put a token on there. We need to put two tokens and one that shows a cog that's one cube of any color okay. to close the portal. Then we go with the location with that portal token on, and we do an action space there to close the portal. Okay. All right, so that's what we're doing. We need to do that within 10 turns or we lose. Woo, all, right. all right. So these demons, <coughs> we, we got to go fight them. Mm -hmm. Roy, can you hand me a couple of the demons up there? They're face oh, these up. these are the bad guys? Yep. So we're going to be fighting these bad guys. And when we fight a bad guy, you we're going to often be using fisticuffs, mm. uh, like this punch oh, snap. or um, a boxing technique. Oh. So these are going to give us fighting tokens, which we're going to be using to fight these bad guys. However, also each bad guy has a weakness. 
So you'll, that's what these tokens, so that yellow cube can be used to do a damage against this guy. Okay. This person, you can use a blue and a green cube to do two damage to the, a noble woman killed by lightning. Oh. Hmm. Um, if you defeat them, or what, when you fight them, they're going to do a wound to you. Okay. Or maybe two wounds. Oh. Um, this, each of these will only do one, but if you have a blue cube or a yellow cube, you'll be able to block that. Okay. Do you have to All spend right. the resource, too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, once you defeat them, they will then go into your deck, and then they become what's on the bottom of the card. So when I draw this person, I get a yellow cube. When I draw this person, I get a gray cube. Okay. Move it up. Got it, got it. So that's enemies that we're going to be coming across fighting. Now, um, we're, that, that's what we need to do. So on our turn, oh. we're, we're going to each take a turn, and that's the end of a round. At the end of a round, the bad guys are going to move, or a bad guy is going to move, and then we deal with that possibly if they're in our spot, and we got to fight them. Okay. Sounds good. Um, <clears throat> and then we move the decision token to the next person. Decision token, as far as I can tell, is mostly just if the ghost moves and there's multiple things to do with it, I can, whoever's the choose. decision token chooses. Okay. Sounds good. We also each have our own personal quest that if we do whatever this quest is, mine says, for example, I put a token on this card whenever I discard or destroy a wound from my action pool or discard. So whenever I heal, I put a token on mm. here. And when I've, and also if I draw the same card as the one I just discarded. Okay. Okay. Um, once I do three of those, I get this card in my deck, and this will be giving me uh, two healing that I can use even on other players. Okay. I put a trophy uh, token on this card whenever I take a shortcut, and I have to charge two of those trophy tokens to add it to my deck, and when I do, it looks like it gives me two gray cubes and uh, choose any other player. Nope, that's two white cubes, two which white is cubes. any color. Oh, that's a that's lot. Wow. That's fantastic. Even better than gray cubes. All right, so two white cubes and then choose any other players and they can draw a card. Yeah, mine's I get to put a trophy on here if I discard or destroy a wound from my action pool or discard pile. And if I charge three of the trophies, add this card to your deck, um, and it has charge one blue, and then I can draw two cards. I love card drawing in these sort of games. Yeah, well, whenever you have a card that is charged, you'll be playing that card up here above your board, and you just can stick the cubes on it, which does two things. You can save the cubes from round to round, mm -hmm. but also when you fill up the charge thing, you'll be able to... Uh, once it's charged enough, you have an extra ability that you'll have in play. Okay. Oh, cool. So let's take a look at some of the cards that are in your deck. So you've already seen Punch and Boxing Technique. When I play these, they'll be adding Fighting Tokens. That's a good left cross <clears throat> right there. That's a left cross. Boom. I knew that. There's also cards that will be adding Money that you'll be able to use this money when you go mm -hmm. to the... There's a spot on the board that you'll be able to buy from and get more cards. Each of us has a Gather One Resource... Um, of a spot we're in. So on the board itself, if I'm in this spot here, for example, and I play that card, I'll be able to take a gray cube or a yellow cube. So different spots will have different resources on them. Interesting. Sure, but I'm putting this back right. I don't even remember. I think you turned it. I think you turned it as well. I think I did too. I think it's like that. Okay. What else you got? Uh, we each have, we each have a, a wild. Hey, get any color cube you want. Mm -hmm. Your resources. And then uh, gain one resource of your choice. It's available in your space. Restock. Oh, it's the same card. Yeah, so I got two of those. Two of those. And then we each have two cards that are own. So for mine, for example, we won't look at all of them, but for mine, I get a green cube. Discard a card from your hand and draw a card. And then this is a, a starting card. Charge three of these. Unlock the second ability of this card. So that's how it is. So let's go up to the board here. <laughs> And what we're going to be doing here in this scenario is, we're, like I said, we're moving around trying to fight things. And on your turn, you're going to be walking through a turn and doing the same things each, each round. So when it's your turn, the first thing that you will do, you'll have five cards in your hand. The first thing you do is you're going to, move, you're going to clean your action pool. Okay. Any tokens or things left over are gone. Mm. So you can't really save stuff from round to round. You, it doesn't really matter except for fighting tokens. Those you can you can use to fight bad guys if they come and attack you on someone else's turn. Okay. And movement tokens, you can save up to four of those, period. They, you're going to slide those over here. Okay. Then, you have a move action. You can discard one card to move one space. Okay. Or you can discard a movement token to move one space. Sure. Oh, nice. You can also use a shortcut if you are here or here. You can spend two movement points to go to this box. 
Um, and then from here, you can spend one movement point to go to any of the locations on either of those spots. Same thing over there, like Super Mario, you can jump into a pipe on either of those two spots, and you go there halfway through. You can't be attacked when you're in that spot, but you also can't attack. Do those both count as shortcuts? Because that counts for my card. That is a shortcut, yes. Both the pipe and this. That is correct. Okay. Oh, so you want to take shortcuts. I want to take shortcuts because <clears throat> that helps me, yeah. Well, I mean, it's very similar to Mike in life. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute now. Always I, taking shortcuts. I tell you what. <laughs> I don't know. That was a joke that, that was, was just, yeah, no, <laughs> just floating there. What were you supposed to do? Look, you have to, uh, you have to do it. You have to, you have to take it. I'm those. writing an email right now. <laughs> <laughs> after, after, so then after your move, then you build your action pool, basically play your cards, put the resources here. Mm -hmm. Then you can take a field action based on where you're at. So some spots don't have anything, mm -hmm. but Got a lot it. of spots do. If you're on this spot, there's an event. And the events are from this deck. Yes, this deck here. The person next to you will draw the event and read it to you. Sometimes they have a choice. Okay. You don't say what will happen. Mm. It's like you, you. I mean, you give them the choices, but you don't tell them what the results. Got are. it. Of course. Got it. Um, so that's that's the thing here. Mm -hmm. Here you get two movement tokens. Okay. Here you heal a wound. Uh huh. Okay. Um, and you can pay a coin or a resource of any color to heal an additional wound. Okay. Um, up here, you can target a bad guy, which means we can wipe those four okay. to draw no more, and then you can take one and put it in front of you, and the next time you fight somebody, that's the one you fight. Oh, okay. So you pick one that you think you have. That you can have a good shot at. When you fight a bad guy, you're picking one of those to fight. Right. Um, and then here where it says buy one, you can buy one thing. There is a row of cards in front of Roy there of four items you can buy from the shop. Ooh, nice. But you can also buy pennies and demonic pennies. Oh. Pennies are worth two, and demonic pennies are just better than that. <clears throat> It's not cheap to pee in flower pots. I mean, it costs a lot of money. You need a lot of demonic <laughs> pennies. That's, that's going to cost you money. Restitution, I suppose. That's right, yes. I think I've covered all the different spots that you can go to on the board. Mm -hmm. So we'll be moving around doing that. We're mostly moving around because we got to get these bad guys. Right. <clears throat> and we do get to draw our hand before we move. So we might be like, okay, I've got a lot of money. I want to stay near this buy one spot. I've got a lot of punches. Yes, in I fact, wanna... let's draw our opening hands now. Yeah, I mean, the fact that I'm there in that spot, uh, combined with the fact that I drew no money cards in my mm -hmm. opening hand. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I, uh, I feel pretty punchy. I think I'm going to probably try to be there so I can target someone. Well, is there that one? Yeah, I'm actually, I think I'm just going to go fight a guy on my very first turn. I will likely do the same. However, they're not really close. Actually, you may not because we're not really close to these bad guys. No, but when you target them, you can put it in front of you, right? Yeah, but you still have to be in the same spot as a miniature. Oh, I see. I see what you mean. Ah, uh, I don't like, is there anyone there that takes three to punch? Yes, the, the succubus, both succu, succubi, that's the plural of succubus. I don't know if you knew that. Both of them. I did know that, and I don't know why I know that. <laughs> yeah, we shouldn't know that. We, we probably shouldn't. And they're All identical. Right. They both take a, a, a blue cube to block and a yellow cube to, to punch. All right, so I'm going to move by spending three cards, discarding three cards. So move me over to that event area. So this is one... No, 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 no. You're Put here. me on the buy one. Okay. That's where we are. So then I go okay. down. One, one two, two, three. Here? Yes. Oh, okay. That's on the portal. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll okay. deal with the portal later. So now I'm going to fight a bad guy. So give me those. Give me the. It doesn't really matter. They're both the same succubus. They're both the same. And they both do one damage. And they both give the same benefit, I believe. Mm -hmm. Yep. They both give you a good All right, so cube. give me one. Let me show people as I, as I beat the snot out of a succubus. All right, so here's a succubus. Requires three to beat. I could also use a yellow as one. I don't have one, but I do have a punch and a boxing technique. So I actually technically, all right, following the rules of the game, I've already played both of those, and I have three fighting tokens here. Okay. Then you spend your fighting tokens? Then I'll spend my three fighting tokens to beat the succubus. The succubus hits me for one wound unless I have a blue, which I do not have. So I am going to take a wound. So give me that wounded card, Roy. Okay, uh, this? Yep. Now, wounds go into my deck here. They're fine, but when they come up, I'm going to have to play them underneath here. 
Mm. And they stay there till they're healed. But while they're there, I draw one less card. Got it. Wow. Um, if you ever have four wounds here, you discard all of them, and you'll draw a Grievous Wound. Mm. Grievous Wounds just go near your board, and if you get a certain number of Grievous Wounds, you're dead. Yeah, and it can't be discarded or destroyed. It permanently lowers your hand. It does not. No? It does not permanently oh, lower your hand, okay. but it will kill you. Got it. And okay. we'll lose. Got it. We don't Rough. want that. So, um, that is my whole turn. Do we immediately flip over a new bad? Uh, yes, 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 yes. Okay, because that, that might determine what I do. Two-headed chicken. So I would. Two-headed chicken. Watch out. I would have bought something that round, but I drew no money whatsoever. I'm kind of in a similar situation. Uh, I did draw one, but one's not going to do. Oh, a lot and for remove me. that figure off the board. Uh. They will be spawned again, possibly. Okay, and. Oh, and I also since I did beat somebody. Right. Right. Uh, oh, let me see if I draw the same card. I just discard it. I, I did. I did. I, I don't know how that works, actually. Anyway, um, this goes on the main quest. Cool, because okay. I want to fight with somebody. Nice. I want to fight with somebody. I want to punch some. Okay. Um, so let me ex uh, make sure I understand how uh, shortcuts work. Hang, hang on one second. All right. Dun dun dun. I need to. Uh, Text our ah, we have to, we have a question for the for the designer. All right, we're good. Okay. No, 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 not a question for the designer. Oh, okay. okay. All right. So if I wanted to take a shortcut, which I do, I would like to end up in this space. So I'm here. Well, that's going to be very difficult Is because it? it's going to cost you one to move here. Right. It's going to cost you two more to go in the shortcut. Uh, it's going to cost you three to come out. It would cost you four then to go to this okay. spot. So then I'm not going to do that. I, w I, I, I will I will forego. Well, I'm going to do something very similar to you. I'm going to discard three cards to go one, two, three. Now I'm in the same space as this here, okay? Then I'm going to fight a... Do I want the three-headed chicken or do I want the uh, succubus? I think the red cube is a reward for one versus a gray cube. So let's just go up to the chicken because I think that sounds more fun. So oh, basically, snap. I've got three punch All right, and a yellow cube. Hand me that cube. chicken, Roy. Here's a chicken. So, so, so you are going after a two-headed chicken. Now, this right. one you could have hit with any cube of any color. Right. Which I have a one. One. All right. All right. So first, let's let's do that. So you're you're taking three and a yellow cube. Right. What is that thing? That, okay. That's one of my. This is a benefit cards. he has his laboratory equipment. So. Yes. So technically, this is all uh, everything you have. Correct. So you could spend a yellow cube and only two of those fighting, but let me tell you why you shouldn't, because you can also take this yellow cube and put it on here. We do need two tokens and a yellow ah. cube to close a portal. Okay. Closing a portal turn one seems good. Amazing. Seems good, right? Yep. All right. So you beat this guy. He did do a He will do a damage to you. Right, so I take a wounded card. Mm -hmm. All right, but you also get the enemy card. goes in your deck. Okay. All right, and then we're going to put that yellow token on this along with one of these. Right. That lets us close a portal. Now, I'm on a portal right now. Do I have to I, take uh, Oh, and yeah. This goes away. Okay, that's right. How do we close a portal? You have to take the portal token, uh, go to a location, and perform an action in the file action space. So someone has to spend a whole action there to close the portal. Okay. I could do it on my next turn. Which I feel like we have to do, and also, well, or you could. You'll actually come up before me. Either one of us could. It depends. I actually want to see what we draw. <laughs> Both of us are going to want to go back and buy more cards. Right. <laughs> right. Roy, tell me you can buy some cards. I have $2 to buy cards with. All right. Just only $2, though. So I guess I take two of these. I do want to buy something before I leave here. For two? Can you do that? You can do that before you no, move? No, 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 no. So movements of. first. So actually, before you do that, you have to decide whether you're moving or not. Oh, dag, that is rough. So and these aren't going to stay from turn to turn, right? They are not. No. I can't even get to anybody to fight because these guy, this guy's way over way here. Way over there. Right? Now, these don't respawn right away, right? No, they're at the end of the round. We're going to draw an enemy movement card, and okay. it will probably... Spawn one. Oh. The other thing, Roy, theoretically. Do I just sit there and buy? I could just sit here and buy. I mean, but I'm not going to have. Wait, can you go there and target anybody? 
Well, no. What that that target does is it just lets you it lets you wipe those, and then you can bring one to you, and that's the one you'll fight next time. But does that count as fighting one of these, or no? No, no, no. It's just when you get to that person, you'll fight them. Oh, strange. I wouldn't worry about fighting right now. I mean, this yeah. is round one, and we've, we've done some pretty. We're, get, we're pretty close to closing a portal now, so. Right. So I get this doesn't stay. From round to round, they just go away. No. And this charge thing, how does that work? I put it off to the side and you put charge it above it. the charge. So yeah, when you put that up there, you put a blue cube on it automatically. Okay. But hey, look, you played another card. You can charge it with another blue cube. That's a yeah. white wild resource. Oh right, so I can put a, another, another blue, blue cube on it. Mm -hmm. And that way, it doesn't go away. It's not wasted. Oh, we right. have to draw a scheme card after each player's turn? All right, uh -oh. never mind. So after my turn... So that means bad guys could come out. Enemy of the crown, figure B. Which one's B? That one's C, the one that I killed. Well, where's the? which one is that one? Uh, this is A. So apparently... B would have moved two B. spaces towards me on my turn. So here... It was there, basically, here. right? Wait, no, it was here. Yeah, yeah. It's here. So okay. it's in my space. That's me, right? So it yes. hits me, and nothing to do about it. So give me another wound. Oh. Oh. Well, now I mean that basically changes everything. I can. So then after, well, hang on. Mm -hmm. So after Mike's turn. Yep. Move C. So C is off the board. So I'll decide what portal C comes in on. Okay. And there's player. I don't. If I bring it in on one of these two portals, it's just gonna hit me or Mike again. I don't want another wound. Right. Um, can you put it in this portal? No. Where's the other two portals? Oh, we're standing on we're them. We're standing on them. standing on them. Oh, my goodness. Well, sorry, Mike. I can't. And it moves two towards me? Yep. I can't take another right. wound card. That's a shame. But hey, good news, Roy. Now you are close enough if you want to. So it, it spawns and then also moves? Oh, the first one is on the board. Sorry, Mike. You're right. The first the first movement is move, move. Okay. So no, that's that's yeah. two, two? That's no mine was already on okay. the board. This was already on the board. Okay. Now I might punch something. I still kind of want to buy stuff, but I could right. get to one of those people and punch them. Um, I think I think Roy. You could also close some, the wait, Somebody's got to buy stuff, right? Uh, I think I think you should buy stuff. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm gonna do what I was gonna do then. So I'll get the two blue on there. Add my two here. I'm going to buy this or buy more buys. This lets me get a green and then destroy a card from my action pool. Or discard pile. Does does wounds go to your action pool or they go to your discard pile? Oh, they do go to your discard yeah. pile. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm gonna take that. Yeah, I like that idea. I mean, because I'm I'm gonna be looking okay. for stuff. Guys, right, so replace that immediately. Okay. Gotcha. Now we've got snuff. So okay. now after Roy's turn, shuffle all cards from enemy crown deck back in the deck. Draw as many new enemy of the crown cards as you previously shuffled in the deck and put them back on the board. What? Wipe and reshuffle. These villains, bad yep. guys. All right. Oh, no one moved here? that turn, at yeah. least. Go go back into that. We reshuffle and draw four more. Yep. Okay. All yep. right. So now Mike gets the decision token. But first player doesn't change. No, I keep. We just keep going around. Okay. But we're now in round two. You can uh -oh. make decisions. Round three, big bad dude comes out. Oh my. Uh oh, there's a hellhound out there now. Now you've got somebody on your spot. Tom. Yeah, but those hellhounds don't seem too difficult because I heard that they were making poops in the they were in the streets. They were making mystical poops. Ooh, I've got some money this turn. Yeah, here's the problem. I can't fight that guy. I got nothing. I mean, yeah, I drew all my money this turn, so that is what it is. Okay, so. I'm going to spend these two money cards okay. to move one. Okay. Because Which it way? costs an Is extra yeah, there. It costs an extra movement to move, to move away from a bad guy. Okay, that's good. Okay, to know. so I did that. So I guess I'm gonna have to do this action then. And then I'm going to gather a resource of your choice. It's at my spot. So there's a yellow or green. I'm actually playing this card here, putting a green on it, and then I'll put another green on it. Okay. Like that. And then I'm taking two money, which isn't going to matter because it's going to go away. Can you, and now we have to can flip to over. Me? I don't think I'm going to be able to flip use my money. Flip one type to the other side. You're on a red circle on a trap. Track. I don't. Do you mean this? I don't actually know what that means. Flip one that type to the other side. One type of what? You went from 
Okay, I don't know what happened there. Yeah, that's just a, that's the round track. So we're in a red circle now. Right. Oh, uh, let me look that up here. Maybe it, maybe so the red circle triggers something. It might, yeah. Uh oh, bum bum bum. Mm -hmm. So the villain moves is not on the map, and the main boss and the okay, okay. Uh, I can get resources. You can use resources to fight back, guys. You can. The only thing I'm I'm concerned about is I'm I'm gonna you have to use. I gotta close the portal, and I've got I drew my money this turn, but that's all right. What do you have to have to close portals? You have to take an action to do it. What is your, what is the action? Well, that's what I'm not sure. Oh, 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 it says flip one tile to the other side? Are these tiles different on the other side? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh. And we have to pick one? We pick which one, or? I guess I'm just picking the one that's farthest away, right? Okay. I mean, what does it matter? It just, there's fewer resources there now. I see, okay. Oh, he's corrupting the entire city! Indeed. Well, that's what happens when you pee in all the flower pots. That's right, it is corruptible. All right, so we have we flipped over Curses. a thingy. I think that guy's in that uh, I flipped over three. I haven't gone yet. Oh. Well, I mean, I'm still going. Okay. Uh, but I now have an event card, so oh. I, I, I ended my turn on that event spot. Got it. Okay. That's why I went there. I'm hoping this is something good. You order a hot dog. You're at the hot dog stand. You order <laughs> a hot dog. I gladly order a hot dog. But the vendor keeps looking at you suspiciously. You look gorgeous, he well. says after a long, awkward silence. Cheered up by the nice words, you forgot about the, do the hot dog and hit the road. You gain one movement token. Oh, that's not terrible. That's no. not terrible. Uh, that's not bad Because I all. can save the movement token. Right. So that actually, next turn I'll be able to use that. All right, so <laughs> I've got a... Uh, I'm in love with the hot dog vendor. <laughs> it said you liked it, but you also... For ran away. Dog. That's right. Well, it's it's it. I was flattered. Right. And frightened. And frightened. <laughs> also, <laughs> so I was I'm a ghost, so right. I'm not sure like well, what he could have done anyway. You're you're a gossamer beauty. Um, so if I close this portal, oh, hang on, I gotta do this nonsense. Oh, okay. Move all enemies of the crown one space towards the nearest player. Uh oh. So. All right, so take, should we? Not I take spawn? another wound, I suppose. We should not have spawned uh, other ones unless they're t they were told to. That correct. one was on the board, though, right? Oh, it was here. Was he there? Yeah. Wait, he was here. Yeah, because yes. remember we only moved the one. So then it goes to me. So yeah. Mike takes another wound. Ah, oh, this is bad. Guys, why are you taking and all these wounds? And then that one, I guess, uh, just spawn it all the way at the end. He there. spawns there. Okay, yeah. that was gonna be my question. All right, so I've got some questions. Technically, I'm not. You made all those decisions. Yeah. Yeah, make those decisions, Mike. Uh, no, I want to put him on Tom's portal. Uh, <laughs> so I'm here now. I've got a, an enemy in my spot. It's going to cost me extra to move out. Um, so I'm probably not going to be able to buy anything. But It costs an extra movement point to go through enemy figures on this board. Only on this board? Well, the hellish one now. An extra one, I guess. But it already is an extra one here. So yes. is that three then? Just to clarify, it's three to go through there. Okay. Um, Rough. So I'm probably not moving because uh, there's, but does it take my whole turn basically to do this portal? Do I get one action? You get one ground action of where you're at, right? So and that's to be done. Your turn there. And that has to be done after you move. Yeah. Okay. So let me go through the the round right. here. So you have cleaning your action pool, which you don't need to do. Right. Then you do your move action. Then you can build an action pool, throw more stuff out. Then you get a field action. The field actions are buy, heal, boost, target villain, event, quest. So this here says go to location with portal token and perform an action in a filled action space to close that portal. So I guess you can't do it if there's a bad guy there. So we got to fight the bad guy oh, first. Oh, man, that's brutal. But I could move there. But uh, it's going to cost you an extra spot. To well, move I mean, away. but that makes that makes more sense, right? I mean, we need to do this. That's the whole point of the game. I don't have, I don't have. Well, maybe I do have three. Maybe I do. Get him. Oh, technically, I didn't have to spend an extra movement to move away from that guy. It only matters on the hellish board. All right. Got well, it. Okay. I didn't have anything else to do with that card anyway. All right. So let's see here. Two. Gotcha. If I gather one. What resources do these guys take? They take anything. Yeah. And that's two of anything. I, I, you know what? I don't know that I do have enough nah, nah, to nah, defeat nah, one nah. of these guys because they each take three. I've got two hits. I could gather one resource. but Yeah, but they take 
No, no, they, they get hit with wilds. Right, but they need two wilds. No, 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 no. That means you can hit them twice with a wild. Oh. Hit them three times to beat them. Okay, then I can defeat this one, but that will take my action. I can't. Oh, no. Would that defeat? Would that take my action? Would I still be your able to close the portal? Your turn. Here's my worry about this. When we do the portal token and play it, we discard all resources and trophy tokens from this quest. So it's a waste of your time to fight the guy. When we put this portal out, everything comes off of here. Why do I want to put another one on there? We have to close the portal first. Before I punch him. You can punch him. Right. I'm just saying it's a waste of your time to do so. Oh, because it's just going to go away. It won't happen twice. Yeah, but okay. then he won't be there to give you wounds as fast, right? Or I get that, but closing the portal. Yeah, that's the. If whole we get, we'll get it. Yeah, he's not there to give so us wounds, but do. putting another token there is a waste of our time. So it only costs me one extra to move away from here, or no? No, it just costs one to move away. All right. So I think what I'll do is. So we're not going to kill the guy. The, the thing is, Roy, is that if I kill the guy, whatever gets put on there is going to get thrown away. But yeah, like you said, that. but like you said, if at least not he's not there to else. hit us. Yeah, but no, he can close the portal. Right. He's standing on one. There's a guy there. He can't close the portal when there's a bad guy there. But he can also kill the bad guy. But then he can't close the portal. Oh, you you're can only do one allowed action. to do one right. thing. Right, right, right. right oh, right. I, right. I didn't realize. You so I move. And. Could I still play a card and then do an action? Like, can I do this charge card? Yeah, you're supposed to. No, so let's do an order. Play all you the always cards move, mm -hmm. then you play all your cards. Oh, okay, got it. Okay, so I'm going to do that. And you say I put one immediately. That's right? correct. And then two more would be able to unlock that. Now I've got three money, which does nothing for me because it's going to go away. And then. Then why didn't you oh, use that to move? Oh, that's a good point. I could do that, right? <laughs> Sorry, I'm still figuring this out, but you're right. That makes more sense. Uh, so I can either gather, I just can gather a blue. All right, so I'll do that. But that's going to go away too, right? Probably, but... Yeah, all right. Okay. I'm just saying at least let's do it that yeah, way. Yeah, 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 you're right. Okay, so that's it. So then we close, then the, portal, close the portal, so all these get wiped. Mm -hmm. And we put the portal token on here, and we're one-fourth of our way to victory. Got oh, it. Oh, I see. Okay. And then we have to do a nasty card. Right? Nasty yes. Card. Nasty card. Nah, nah. Move all enemy of the crown figures to the central London tile of your board. Set each of them in a different space. All right. Central. Uh, this. That's this one. Well, there's one of each. One in each. Right, but this is the central London tile. Yeah. Unfortunately, that means one's gonna hit me or who? Who's right. Alice? Roy, you get yeah. hit once. Right. Uh, wait, unless you unless you have a cube, saved. Actually, 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 no, 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 no. He could. Block because he could use one of those blue cubes. Could he? I also have a card that lets me get. Well, does anyone thing. have a blockage thing with a blue cube? They do. The hellhounds are wild. You can block yeah. with anything. So you could. I'm going to save it because I have a thing that lets me discard two, and discarding them lets me get trophies on this. Got it. So. All right. Speaking of that, uh, the, your problem, turn. the problem is so these two here, the two wilds there, mean you can only hit them twice with cubes. You still That's correct. Need an you still punch. need another action punch. I can't. I can't do it. I'm not going to be able to gather the resources to do it. Um, do Does damage persist or you have to take out the entire three? Well, that's a good question. I bet. Yeah, you have to do all of them. I did ask that. Well, yeah, then I can't. I If I can only do two. If I have no punches in my hand, I can't kill any of the stuff out there. Cause no matter how many resources I gather. So. Wait, if you have two punches, you said, in your hand? Or no punches in your hand? If I have no punches. Yeah, in yeah, hand. you can't. Oh, did you draw all your punches on the first turn? Yes. All of us drew that? That's that's like incredibly bad luck. But there was no way for me to get to the bad We guys. all... See, it would have been better if we all draw money the first okay, turn and I'm then the we're fighting. Here. I'm going to get rid of this wound, which gives me a trophy on this. What does that let you do now that you have it charged up? Um, well, I have... Oh, the blue thing. Oh, this. Um, I can prevent wounds. Um, I can prevent two wounds that may be dealt from a retaliation when fighting a villain. That's kind of cool. I just wish I could. I could gather... A bunch more resources. I could gather more blues, but it doesn't do me anything, right? No, you can't gather on that one. That that token actually covers them up. Oh, well, I could move. I could have moved oh, together. I see that. I'm just gonna spend my two coins, I guess. If there's a way to send people towards me, I should be able to punch. I well, if you have it. two movement, oh, you're gonna just buy again? Yeah. Why not? I don't know. Why not? I don't know. What is this green? Is that give you green? That's green. healing. Heals oh. wounds. Mm -hmm. Healing's good for me. If, can you heal can somebody you? else now? 
No. All right. Okay. So I'm playing a wound. Wait, we haven't done a. Oh yeah. Can we do a bad card for me? Move an enemy of the ground figure A one space towards the nearest player. Where do we see the letters? Where are the letters on these? They're like all on me already. Oh, that's so C. This is A. It's on me. Okay. So it hits me. Is that how yep. that works? I take a wound. Yep. All right. Um, I'm just gonna take it because I can hopefully give the decision get rid of it. token to Roy. Okay. Listen, so I'm gonna make the decisions here. here. The bad guy shows up here, and we reveal the new bad guy. Let's show this card. This is the hottest royal demon, Pueblo. Whoa. Uh oh. That guy is so no good. No. Just to just to clarify, um, when he hits us, uh, if, if if you could answer this ready game, since I wasn't supposed to look at this, if this guy hits us, does he do five damage? Minus sure, one for each cube that we sure don't block. Looks like That's it. what it looks like. Wow. <laughs> sure so. sure looks like it. <laughs> Listen, I can prevent some damage. So I don't know where you guys is at. All right, all right. Let's put that guy back over here. Uh, I'm going to, and also, how does he move? Well, I guess, do any of these move him? Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, I have to look. I don't actually know how he moves. Cool. Um, I'm still really I'll look that up in a second. Let me, let me go first. Okay. Um, so I have one last action. I can I, I can hit something, so there's no reason not to. I could I'm too, just but going I'm, to. I don't think I can get to him. So move me. I'm going to spend my... Uh, it's kind of a waste. Just move all the bad guys to me and let me die. Move me one into that space with the there. If I take a bunch of damage, Alrighty. I can get rid of it. So I have to discard a card to do that. I'm going to discard uh, this one, I guess. All right, so I'm going to play a white to take a green. Okay. Then I'm going to take a gray. And then I'm going to take a two punch. Two punch. Oh, snap. Now give me one of those hellhounds. I think I can beat the hellhound. Beat it. Beat it. Actually, you know what? I'm actually going to, instead of putting the green on here. Save the green so you don't take a wound? Yeah, I am. Mm -hmm. So the hellhound here, I'm going to beat it with a gray cube and two fighting. And then I'm going to discard a green cube to not take a hit. Okay. Uh, the main bad guy moves one space at the end of each round to the nearest player. Okay. Okay. So he's uh, just going to keep coming after us. Good news is, though. I've beaten another bad guy. Indeed. So I put a token. Is, was, did you just put that there? No, that was the that that's was, the portal. That's the you portal. Put the trophy oh there. yeah, the I put the trophy there. Got it. And did you put a? Did you? Was there a uh, cube also that you could put on there or no? Have no, I spend the time not getting myself hit. Got it. Okay, and so now he's going to move towards the nearest player, which so is going to be one. Doesn't matter. Just, you know, Roy makes a decision. Oh yeah, which way? There or there? Uh, wait. Um, I guess. He, he. Okay. A now moves two spaces to the nearest player. Does that mean it hits me twice? It's on my space. Oh, I guess just there, so it hits you one more time. Okay. Oofed. Oh, I didn't. Get, I got that rid of that wound. I shouldn't have. Um, so I'm only going to be drawing four cards. Okay. Ouch. And it cost me two, ah. two to move out. Of, two to move out of here, right? Yeah, I gotta go heal, guys. I don't have any. Oh, take that figure C off the board. Okay. Get out of here. This is rough because I actually want to punch people, but I don't think I can get to them because it would cost me two, three, four to get over there. Right? Nah. Although you could go here, end your turn, I suppose, and take the two. I could. Move man and just prep for next turn. Ah. I don't love. Should we have turned over another thing? Ready, there or no? Ready says that someone asked, does dying equal player eliminate it? And he says, yes, but it's extremely hard to die in this scenario. <laughs> Challenge accepted. Uh -huh. <laughs> give us, just give us our I chance. It doesn't feel like it's hard to die. It feels no. like that big guy's going to hit one of us soon, and he's right. just going to wail on gonna, us. going to wreck us. Okay. I've already drew my second wounded card, mm -hmm. so I'm I'm not I'm not having a good day. My issue is I've I got have a lot of stuff to heal wounds, but I wish I could help other people do that too. You know. Yeah. This location here can let you heal, right, Tom? Yeah. If you go here. Yeah. So quick question here. 
and you're one space away from it. So maybe going to heal isn't the worst idea. I'm just gonna stand where I'm at. Yeah, okay. I'm, I gotta go game. heal on my turn. I don't have any uh, any way yeah, around it. Yeah, yeah. I feel like, oof. But if I go over here, first of all, I'm further away, slower to get out of here. Eh, it's probably not the best option, I right. suppose. Maybe you want to go take that event. I think I might have to do that. Okay, so it's going to cost me two to get out of here. So one. No, 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 no. It's two if there's a bad, bad guy. guy. Oh, got it. Okay. So I only need two to get over there. The problem is the portal that we took out was the farthest one away. Yeah. This one's also. Well, I know. This one's technically the farthest one away. Yeah, can we bring in all new bad guys on that That's one? That's the case. Right. If I can get there in three, I might still be able to... Wreck them? Maybe. One. Wreck them, Ralph. Two. The problem is you How cannot, much does he take? You cannot three. kill a bad guy if you don't have a punch in your hand. Yeah, I do have a punch. I was saying for three. me. Yeah, I could take I'm out a hellhound. Myself. I could take out a hellhound. So if I move here... I'm going to spend uh, the whole game uh, in the yeah. spot. The uh, ready game says if you go there, the mini boss is going to beat the snot out of you. If I go there... Yes, he will. <laughs> All right, I'll just go here. Ah! All right. Two. I'll go ahead and play these out because why not? One, and this could be... Oh, this could be a yellow cube, which I can then put there. And then this is a red cube. Yeah, I, I don't... I, I actually need to look up... I don't understand charge cards, actually. Yeah. Like, when they're charged... Maybe you have to discard them to do the thing that it says. I don't know how that works. Or put them in your discard pile at that point. I don't know. Yeah, mine, it says get a get three movement tokens, and then you can move through a shortcut. Yeah, it's a one-time use, and then it goes to your discard pile. Okay. So now I'm on this. So I don't read that, right? Somebody else reads Yeah, Roy does. Here. Uh, I'll take it. All right. <clears throat> you find a pie with, sure, don't eat me. It's fine, written on it. Eat it. Is it key Since when are pies so passive aggressive? You turn, you turn the the baking upside down and read the inscription. Ouch! Yuck! Sure, don't talk about, don't talk about my feelings. Choose one. In fear of conflict, <laughs> take the pie and put it in your pocket. Or two, we won't talk about this. You yell and dump the cake into a nearby rubbish bin. <laughs> I want to, <laughs> <that's not> the, <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Read those choices again. You can either, in fear of conflict, take the pie and put it in your pocket, or um, choose the second choice is, we won't talk about this. You yell and dump the cake. Uh, I'm going to make a wild assumption this is not an American pie. Probably not. Because I don't think you can put an American pie in your pocket. No. So let's just assume it's like one of those hot pies. Yeah, right? like, like, a, like, a, like a McDonald's pie. I don't think you should ever... Put a pie in your pocket. No. I don't care what it is. I think generally speaking, that's a good... I'm, I'm really depressed because that was, that was going to be my next brand and my adventure mm. was going to be pie in the pocket. Pie in the pocket? Oh, hang on. So so you can either stick the pie in your pocket or, or throw just, it in the trash. Or just say we're never going to Neither one of these options again. is good. No, they're not. I'm putting the pie in my pocket. Add the item card Apple Pie Vampire into your deck. Oh. 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 Where's the box? Here it is. There's a pie Now, if it goes into my deck, is it going to my discard pile? Yeah, I guess so. I, I guess so. What's problem. it called? Apple Pie Vampire. Apple Pie Vampire. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong cards. Where are the um, advanced Oh, here go? they are. Apple Pie. <laughs> <laughs> we'll need to show that one off whenever we find it. <laughs> That's a card. Okay. So we have Apple Pie Vampire. Ooh. That heals you one and gives you a red. I love it. I wonder when you will do something for me. Don't do nothing for this pie, Mike. No. No, no, no. But also, you stuck a piece of pie in your pie. Just out of curiosity, Roy, what if you had picked the other option? Um, you hear it say, fine, in, in the trash can, and then uh, you destroy the card, you destroy this card, and gain one movement for being assertive. Oh, no, I like the apple pie. Yeah, apple pie is much better. better. Good, good choice. Thank good you. choice. Good Wait, choice, Mike. the bottom of the deck, or? Uh, yeah, well, I don't think we're ever going to, we're not, we better not be drawing that many events. Like, right. Oof. All right. So you're done, Mike. Yep. Now we're going to flip. Oh, now, do these go away? or do No, these, but keep those stay. in case you get attacked by right. a, a monster. At least a red one you can use, hopefully. To, to block, hopefully, yeah. It's at the beginning of your turn. So Let's move go. that one up. Uh, yeah, let's move it to the red spot because I don't want to go through it. Here? Yeah. Okay. That's where you are. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. 
Never mind. <laughs> can it go on the same spot as something? See, else? I'm a ghost, so I keep thinking I'm one of the bad guys. Can it go no, on the same spot go. as another one? I don't see why not. Okay. Move C one space towards the nearest player. Is C the one we killed? Um, this one, yes. Boom. Okay. One space. All right, Roy. Oh goodness, I I still can't beat anything. I still can't. I have zero punch, and all of them. None of these have enough resource icons to defeat them with just resources. So, oh, this is brutal. I'm going to play this and discard two wounds from my action pool, which will fill this all the way up. Um, so Beating. now I have three charges on this. Um, once I have three charges on this, I add it to my deck, which will allow me to draw cards with it. Which is cool. So I think your wounded cards technically stay here. In your action pool, right? Right. Well, yeah. I put them below my, yeah. my board here. Um, and I'm going to play this resources card to get a random wild resource. Um, what does that guy hit for? The nasty guy. He hits for a lot. It's like for five. Everything. Pretty much every color will save you from him. But yellow and gray are the worst too. Although yellow and gray can be used to fight against him. None of us can beat him with our starting resources. Because even if you draw your two into one and have both those resources, that's only five. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I can still block one of the damage. Did anyone draw yellow. an extra punch type thing? Oh, I got I, one. Uh, yeah. oh, you got the, I have no. A star, I have a starting one. The Hellhound I beat gives me an extra one. But again, I would have to draw all this mm -hmm. on the and same green. turn. Yeah. Um, and I can trash a card. Oh, are any of these But that's not even how we win, right? This. We win by doing the... the Sure, I just didn't want to kill him, so he's and out for the case. four dollars, and I'm going to spend it on getting this wind-up crow so I can actually start doing some damage. Do some damage, Roy. Well, Quick question, maybe. Ready Games. Do If we beat the mini-boss, does he ever come back? Will he like keep respawning? Yeah, that's right. That would be awful. Well, if that's the case, then I don't know that I've got my way to fight him. Right. All right, we're in round four. That means we're going to be flipping over another tile, right? Uh, maybe okay. that one over there? Yeah, sure. Yeah. All right, and then uh, the bad guy moves and hits me. Oh, it's me, isn't it? Or it's Roy. Um, I can prevent some. Um, wait, it's here. It goes, who's got the decision? Roy's got the decision token, so it's going to either go to you. I'm wait, guessing where are it's you, Tom? Go this to is you, me. right? Yeah, it's either going to go to you or to Roy. You can't prevent, like, any of it, can you? Or it I could actually prevent go, any it of it. It could go to me, too. I think it should go probably to me, because I can prevent two... Three, four of the damage. I, and I can prevent three. Um, well, so I'm guessing. It wait, how can me. you prevent three? One, two, three. That card will go away if you I do know, that. I don't want to do it. I'm saying I could. Cool. Well, I guess that's what I'm so doing. So it's going to you? I guess it's going to me. And I get rid of this card. And I spin these two. So that prevents. Actually, you can't. No. You what do you mean? This says prevent two damage. Oh, I see, I see, I see. I thought you were using it just to prevent the damage. No, 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 no. Because you could spend no, no, no. three blues. I'm to do using that. the ability on it to prevent the damage, and I'm using. So you're preventing these. four of the five damage. You just take one. Yes, I take one damage. I take one wound. <sighs> okay. Also, the enemy at the crown figure that's close to you moves three spaces towards you, Roy. Oh my gosh. Are you serious? I'm serious. That's it's just this one. one, right? Man, that's rough. So then I take another damage. There's not much I can do about it. Oh, by the way, it doesn't come back to life. Okay. Oof. I don't know that that's going to matter much. Because I don't know if we're going to be able to kill it. Yeah, and it's back to you. All right. I'm going six, to spend. Six oh, I got another wounded I'm gonna card. Have to leave. I'm going to have yeah. to leave just to get away from this thing. I'm spending this to move down to the heal spot. You are here. No, I'm, I'm, I'm the ghost. You're the ghost. Wait, You're he moving. moves in between each of our turns? Yes. yes. Doesn't that mean he's just going to hit me over and over and over again? Is that the case, Ready? I'm a little confused about that. Does that mean Roy gets hit three times in a row? Because if case, so, it's a little confusing on how that works. <laughs> so just back it up. Um, you could also spend the money to, to, to remove an extra one, too. Yeah, I mean, we're a little we're a little confused on how the main bad guy works. So he moved into Roy's spots, he hits him. So then will he hit him at the end of my turn and right. then hit him at the end of Mike's turn? Right. So the ten more damage, which would make your it's hard to die in this scenario <laughs> seemingly not quite <laughs> not true. Not so hard, yeah. And if that's the case, then it has to hit me. Yeah. Because I go next, and at least I can move away from it. Mm -hmm. But then it would still move into Roy. It would still right. Yeah. But yeah, we're really confused about the bad point, guy. I don't know then, how. At that point, I could then 
use my stuff to stop it, but it's still gonna hit me again before his turn on his turn. Mm -hmm. So then I take the six damage, um, which is rough. Mm -hmm. So only when he enters a location, he fights. Oh, thank goodness. All right, fine. All right, so I'm I'm getting I'm taking three coins, but only one. Okay. Um, I'm spending that coin to be able to heal two of my wounds. Right. So I heal one automatically and spend the coin to heal the other one. Right. Unfortunately, that's my whole wasted turn. Mm -hmm. You know, all right. Uh, B moves one space towards the nearest player. Is B already with you, Roy? Everybody's with me. Yeah, Except for I, that one. I don't think he does another wound to you because he said he only when he enters his space. That's even the small guys? I don't know. But then wouldn't we just sit there with the bad guys and just... And never well, you it. also never can't do anything yeah. when you're with the guys either, though. I can fight them back on my turn. But you can't do anything else. That's about to say. I feel like I'm at the perfect space then. I just yeah. stand there and if they're not going to hit me each time... Yeah, you fight on your turn. No matter whatever the outcome of a fight. Okay, villain phase. The villains will move. Uh... If it tells you move to a player, and okay, the decision. If it makes a move, and as a result, the miniature ends up in the same location, perform a fight action. If the miniature that's supposed to move is already in the same location, it does not move and does not fight. Oh, okay. that actually matters because I does feel matter. like you guys might have spawned them on you, you know, instead right. of spawning them. Well, but then they are they are arriving at a space with you at that point. Yeah, but then they're just going to sit there. And right, so they'll hit you at least one they time. They hit you one time. All right, so we do need oh, to Oh, uh, yes. Uh, Reddy says, look at my class crest. You get a trophy by healing. Oh, you're right. Thank you. Oh, sweet. Yeah, it's good. And start thinning that off. Mm-hmm. I just want to live long enough to uh, get my wind-up crow out of my discard pile and play it and hit somebody. I want to get boom, some good cards. All right, well, I kind of, this is probably, have we flipped over the thing really? yet? We did, right? And yeah, yeah, we just did right. that because it was so all So I've got these two wounds, but I think what I may have to do on my turn is just get rid of them. Uh, it's kind of a boring thing, but. Yeah, because you only draw three cards. Right. And we can't afford to have right. you only drawing three cards. Yeah, exactly right. So I think what I'll do then is play these two to move. One, two. Play that to heal. Because I heal one eventually, and, or immediately, and then that would yep. heal the other one. Do you one. get a thing when you heal? I don't. No, when this you take a shortcut. This is only for taking shortcuts. <laughs> Mike, you haven't taken any shortcuts this game. Well, the thing is, I was if I could have charged a third one there, then I would have been able to move through a shortcut. Cut. But these now oh, go gotcha. away, correct? Because it's the end of my turn. Actually, I probably should have gone away at the beginning. They go away at the turn. beginning of your turn. All right. All right, bad guy. B, two spaces towards the nearest player. Where's B? It's on me. All right, cool. So, uh, so, so as long as you just gonna... stay there, Roy, like a magnet, well, but, attracting everybody. But time, yeah, time is ticking away as we do that. So we are going to have de to deal with them at some point. Okay, it's back to me. I just wanted to get rid of those wounds, you know. Um, yeah, I would love to do something. The problem is the there's been a couple times where I've been in a position to be able to punch some people, and I just couldn't do it for one reason or another. You're talking about in the game. In the game, yes. Because Roy is within punching distance. I don't want to. <laughs> I'm just going to put it out there. Are you there. trying to punch me? I'm just no, saying. No, Mike can only swing with his right. And so. I'm a lefty, Tom. Are you a lefty? I'm a lefty. Oh, sorry, Roy. <laughs> I got a pretty wicked left jab. I'm not going to. Are you allowed to gather resources? <laughs> yeah. When's the last time you've used your, right, your jab? It's been many years. <laughs> oh, you said you can't. Gather resources. Here. One, two. I have never three, in my four. entire adult life. Been in a fight. Well, no, this wasn't that. when I did. I, really I, I like actually that. boxed for, for. Oh, you boxed for? I, I boxed for uh, exercise mode. I haven't even done that yeah. in my adult life. Yeah, I used to enjoy. I, I think okay, like I'm boxing. Take, I loved it. Actually. I don't understand why you would want someone to punch you in the face. Well, first of all, you're wearing headgear. I'm gonna take hip flash. Uh, doesn't it hurt though? Not really. I mean, it, it can. If it, but I'm it's going not that to. Bad. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. Spend two. No, what I about going against Mike? What about Tyson. when? Punch. Okay, okay, I get that. So, no, like, if, if I punch you right now, mm -hmm. I'm not strong. Sure. Oh, sure you are. With a boxing glove on. Yeah. It doesn't hurt that much. It stings. What the, the 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 worst I got hurt in a sparring thing was with an uppercut. That really hurt. 
that that did the stars and everything else. Oh, okay. But like a straight. Did it lift punch, you off your feet? I, yeah, I did the glass Joe. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Sorry, no. we're um, off topic. Here. Sorry, Roy. Am I only allowed to fight or buy, or can I fight and buy? No, you can. As long as those bad guys are there, you can only fight. Okay. Well, I guess I. Punch. Did you draw a bunch of money? I drew. I drew a little bit of money. I will tell you. I'm in a. I'm money. in a position where I can. I can do some. Some damage next turn, if I can get there. Yeah, we're coming up to help you fight, Roy. So I'm going to fight. I don't think I should leave because then they're going to start moving to me again. You know. I tell you what. So I'm going to punch two, three, this four, doggy. Five. I'm close to being able to to kill him. I'm not quite there. I'm one one short. Well, same here, but that doesn't yeah, matter. Oh, but five is pretty good. And no, that's what I, I said, though. For yeah. six, you need that one extra card. Yeah. That draw card. All right, bad guy. All my wounds are back C, in my deck. C, okay. C's already on the board, or no? Is that C? C is down here. Two spaces. All right. Decision token's probably been moved at least once. Yep. Okay, so now we're on round five. Is it a red? No. Okay. And we have ten rounds to do this, or eight rounds? Ten. Ten, okay. Uh, we've closed one portal. One, I'm aware. Two, we're we're two, not going to win. Four, I just like to five, Probably, yeah, although we should flip over another baddie over there. I, I can knock out a baddie next turn, for sure. I knocked one out. You put a thing on it, right? All right, I'm using a I movement so. token. I don't think he did. You didn't put a second one on there for when I just knocked one out. Oh, no, you didn't. I did not. Did you use a cube? I, don't, I didn't have any. Okay. Oh, actually, that. well, that actually changes everything, then. It changes everything. Because I should just shut down a portal. Can you do that? Do we don't need a cube to shut a portal? Well, I'll get a cube. Okay. Then yeah, um, that's the whole point of the game. Yeah, so I discard one movement, two movement, three movement. Move me over to this portal. One, two, three. Okay. And then discard a card from your hand and draw another card. Not that that matters. No. Oh. Without giving you your... I could have beat the big bad guy. Ah! But how was I supposed you, to know you that? You can't know. You All can't. right. Anyhow, um, so then I put the cube on here. Actually, you moved before you drew. Yeah, you have to. Yeah, you have to move first. Um, is there a green resource in that spot? There is. So not only that, but I'm also charged. This is charged. Okay. Uh, but I did that and that. So another portal token. Another so portal we're token. Through. So we're halfway. All right. All right, so now we got to flip over a bad a bad card. I'm feeling okay. Yeah, we're, we're getting there. C, one space towards another player. Roy's going to have everyone with him soon. I'm going to come Wait, up where's the one you just whooped on? I thought you just beat one. Oh, yeah, one of these should be dead. Okay. Which which card matter. was it? Do we know? Did you, did you get well, rid of it? Well, hang on, Roy. Take, uh, yeah, B. B's the right one. Now, did you take the card out of there? That yes. You be, oh, okay. Well, He's in my deck. Oh, okay, got it. Yeah, right, that's right, 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 right. That's right. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I may discard. No, 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 no I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I can discard two cards in my hand. Mm -hmm. At the end of my turn, I'm going to use my ability here. Okay. Discard two cards in my hand and draw new ones in their place, and then choose any other player and draw a card. Mike, draw a card. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ooh. Oh. 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 No. Maybe. Because it's the gathering. It's a roller coaster oh. emotions. Yeah, well, no, because the oh. gathering. Yeah. Wait, no, no. Uh, oh, because he's covering it up. Shoot. Yeah, if he wasn't covering up resources, I'd be able to well, hit him with more space. cubes. That's yeah. space. You right. can't get resources in. Yeah, 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 yeah. That stinks. Uh, yep. Because otherwise, I could beat him. Almost that was a good. So it was close. a good call, though, Tom. I mean, it was it was worth the shot. So close. But I still feel like I should go up there and punch, right? I mean, that's that's how we that's how we win this game. <laughs> what? Yep. What's going on? Oh. Now? It's not the actual stream. Come on. Oh, okay, good. It's just this local TV. Okay, so I'm here. I need to go here. I need to go to, well, I could go here and knock this guy out, right? I don't have to go up here. Although, would it help you, Roy, if I went up and punched someone where you're at? I don't know if it's going to help me or hurt me. I'm just kind of right. there. Um, if you take the three guy out and there's no threes there, then I'm going to have to leave the space because I'm going to have nothing else to do. But I'm going to punch the three if he's there. Okay, then let me go over here and leave you that guy. All right, so I'm going to spend these because I'm not going to be used money. So I go I one. Not going to be used money. Two, right? Then, oh, that's good because I'll be able to use this too. Mm -hmm. All right, so I spend these. Yeah. And that's going to do four 
and one, but I can use this one mm -hmm. for th for that, right? Gotcha. To put it on that card. So I can take out E, well, is he gonna hit me back? Not if I not if I kill him, or will he still hit me back? They Do you remember still that? will hit you back, definitely. Okay. But oh, but I can, just take yeah, it. I just gotta take it, I think. Let's do that. Well, because I could use this to block that one, but we... Can you not gather the cubes there? No, because that's an action, isn't it? I don't think gathering the cubes is an action. That's the cards in your hand. So you move, uh, you do those, the action is actually fighting him. Okay, so I'll do, you're right. So, yeah, so I'll do that. So technically I'm getting four of these guys. Got it. Okay, so four of these, a yellow cube, which I put there, which now says get three movement tokens <clears throat> and you can move which I'm not going to do. All right. You can do that your next turn. But you still have a yellow cube to put on the thing over there? I do. I have actually I have I have a yellow or green cube. Cool. Cuz I have two of them. Well, yeah, I'd get I'd put one on Let's the portal over there. All right. So, you beat the big bad guy? No, I wish, but I did beat uh that um that guy over there, it's got to be the left one because I'm blocking that yellow by gathering a yellow here. Okay. And then the other one will be a yellow or a green to, to do that. So we get a trophy over there, and we can either put a yellow or a green over there. It doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. No, it doesn't matter, right. Okay. Um, I used these to, to punch them. And then... Why I, are there two portals and not two? Because we destroyed two portals. This one goes into my deck, too. Oh, and we're working okay. on the next one already. So yeah, when yeah, I yeah. did this, I charged this, I got these three. Yeah, then that goes in your discard pile. Right. This goes away. Okay. Oh, is it when I play it that I get the three? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Maybe you want to hang on to that. No, no, no. Why, why would you play it now? It lets you move no, through no, a shortcut. No, no, you're saying it goes into my discard pile, isn't it? But it lets you go through a shortcut. Okay, so I just keep the three on it? Yeah, I would we'll just keep the three on team. Oh, okay, turn. got it. All right, got it. Yeah, why not do through the shortcut? Yeah, yeah, and you no, get that's fine. Thing. That's fine. I don't know that you're going to get to that. All right, all right, shuffle all those and draw new ones. Okay. I actually like that one. Mm-hmm. Shuffle well, him in too while you're at it. <laughs> right. Let's no replace threes, him with a wing. If there's no threes, I'm not going to be able to destroy anything. So yep. we have to leave the room. Well, the space I haven't moved from that space the whole game, so I might have to leave it. I have you not leave moved from there the whole game? Pretty much. He's no, been there. I, what do you mean pretty much? I haven't left the space. Oh, Roy right. has determined that that is his That's his space. Thing. I wanted to buy cards, but then all these baddies came here and stopped me from buying cards. So now I have to river. beat them with my spiked baseball bat. There you go. That's how it goes. Is that three? That's a no. dandy. Is that three? That's a three. That's, That's a hellhound. Hound. Play. Oh, the hellhound's good because it gives you an extra fighting. Yeah, I can actually prevent the damage from the hellhound, I think. By the way, if I can beat the big bad guy and that doesn't do anything. this card, I'm Just doing it. get rid of the wound. Uh, I agree. And get a blue. But I can't yet. I'm going to do three damage to him, and then I throw the Hellhound, and then I'm going to also um, use this blue to prevent the damage he's going to do back to me. And he counts as a punch when he comes out of my deck in the future. All right, so we have another trophy um, on here. So we can close another portal. Yes. Where are the other two portals? Mike's Over here. Oh, I'm so far from them. I'm close. Um, but that's my turn. This guy's dead. Uh, maybe. Let's see we if he We killed him. We killed all the guys. Move them all to the central London tile of your board. Are you serious, <laughs> Thomas? <laughs> wow. Where are you taking where, our damage? Where does it go? Where I'm at? One in each one. What? How has this happened to me? You've been destined to be in the Thames River boats. One, two, three, four, five. Mm. I might try right. to heal some of these wounds, but it does not work very well. Oh, by the way, folks, I apologize. I said that this Kickstarter was live. It's not live yet. It's going live at noon. Noon oh, Which today. is 57 minutes from now. Woo! Set your clocks. Set your Do watches. It. Do it. I'm going to start moving this way towards closing that portal out. <sighs> it's my turn. Mm -hmm. I don't really know what to do here because, yes, I can go fight something. But... I wish you could take the big bad dude out. But... Yeah, so I'm going to... Oh, you're, I see what you're saying, because it would get wasted a little bit, right? Because you clear everything off of that. Oh, yeah, this was discarded, too. I, I wish I could Paul Atreides on the top of my deck. <laughs> you love the Paul Atreides maneuver. I don't Why know. don't you just go here and do I just a, like knowing if, if drawing is I thought about that, but I also wonder if I should move into the ghost area. Well, Because they could all move into him. Is there a three? I mean, no, there's not. There's a four. No, I There's can't even kill a four. Fours. No, I can't kill one. Really? Even, right. with the, even with the cubes? Yeah, I'm just going to move one. 
All right. You doing the event? Well, I got a whole pile of stuff here. It's crazy. I have all these resources, but nothing right. to spend them on, unfortunately. Well, if we can kill these the guys, we can you don't, Oh, you don't have a single punch. Discard a card from your hand, then draw a card. Come on, let's oh. be the same card. Oh! 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 <laughs> oh! <laughs> Are you okay? You're very excited. What happened? What does it do? You know, it says put a token on this yeah. card. If you discard the same card, you just right. drew. Right, but now what do you get for it? Oh, you need, you need one I more. need three. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh! He was so excited about putting one trophy. You shut up! <laughs> you, real, you, realize that, with his you realize that I, I finished howling. mine like forever ago. Just letting you know. Oh! I haven't done one. <laughs> oh, man. I have so many resources. I know. Oh, I, I'm just going to take you ones that... You should take them in case they hit no, you. No, no. I'm going to take all the ones that block from this right. dude. All right, so... I, okay, so what what does he need? He's red. red He's not blue, coming to green. you. Red, As blue. long as I don't move. Right. I can take red and blue. I can't take green, but I can take gray. Oh no, I do get a green from that one. <laughs> All right, I have a lot. I think you're I also think you're I'm safe. wounded again. Yeah, that's a bummer. All right, now we flip over a card. Okay. Oh, I only draw four. Uh, a one. Space I'm the decision master. Player. I'm moving it to not me. Oh no, it's already on me. Oh, that's good. That's good. Okay. I tried. <laughs> All right. So I know I need to go. Wait, we're close on the round uh, six. We actually should have flipped another tile. Oh. Uh, that that one, maybe? one. We're never going there anyway. Right. Yeah, we're never going there. You're right. Oh, I didn't draw my event. Come on, this is like super fun for me. All right. All right. Let's hear more pie stories. You're gonna like this, Tom. I'm gonna get out my spectacles for this one. There's a lot of text. Uh-oh. I'm putting it in my pocket. A badly told joke. In my pocket. Someone in the crowd, maybe in the elevator or maybe in the stadium, told a joke, but completely wrong, totally killing it. Yet you still appreciated the whole concept, and later you tried to tell this joke to your friends, but you ruined it right away by starting with the puenta? Well, whatever. I'm it's guessing that's just, a yes. It's probably just translation. You tried again and again and again and again and again and again, but each time you failed. What the heck is going on? Is that joke cursed? You slowly fall into madness. Ha! Joke's on you. That's it. All right. You got <laughs> nothing. All right. <laughs> Did not know there was nothing events in the deck. Apparently there is a <laughs> But I know that in, now. In, indeed you do. Joke's on you. Joke's on you. All right. I'm going to play the last penny to go here. Yes, Mike. All right. Then I'm going to play this for a whatever cube, right? Uh, let's just make it a yellow cube. Why not? Or make it a red cube. Are you shooting a portal then? Huh? Yes. Then I'm playing that for a fist. Then I get a heal. Do I have a? Oh, maybe I don't. I thought I had a. No. I don't. That doesn't do me any good. I get another red cube. Then I play that. I get another red cube. I got lots of red cubes. I hope a red but enemy attacks you. Now we can get rid of that. There's another portal. Give me the portal, please. of the way. Mike, you're going to have to shut down another uh, portal. So me and Roy will fight for you. That's the plan. I'm going to try to take out another monster here. Now, I can't. Uh, uh, Actually, no. I guess I'm not. Now, if I do this, it would, we'll it would make no sense, right, to, to do this. All that this. The only reason I'd be moving through shortcuts is to charge this up and add it to my deck. but Which doesn't really matter at yeah, this point. Right. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, you could still do it to get the three movement. Oh, but you can do that anytime, so what does it matter? Yeah, you might as well save it till you need it. Right. Save it till you need it. Okay. Oh. My turn? Wait. Oh, I have to take a jokes on you. Oh. oh sorry. That that single card there, Roy, is the jokes on you card. Tripping on shrooms. Okay. A Mushka? false sense of motion. When this card is in your action pool during the fight field action, you may only play... Whites for the enemy of the crown weakness pool. That's the wilds. So it means that you can't use the weakness stuff nearly as well. You can only use the white ones. Me smash wild cards in your action pool during your fight. Field action all resources in the enemy of the crown death pool count as wilds. Oh, so it makes it harder. Put and red when easy. you take the fight. So, so 
give me a, give me a card. I, don't, I, I want to look at this. Okay. When this card is in your action pool during your that. field action, you can only play whites for the enemy of the crown weakness pool. I don't understand that's it because white's know. wild. Unless that means my gray. My entire hand is cards I don't that I bought that. and wow. my special card. That's good. It says I can only play whites for the weakness pool, but whites are anything. So how's that bad? In other words, if you have greens, you can't play greens. You have to play white. No, there is no white. White's wild. Oh. Oh, yeah. And I, I get here that all these count as white, so that makes sense. Mm -hmm. That makes it easier for me to hit them. Maybe you have to have white tokens to be able to That's do That's kind of what I'm thinking. Is you so have to actually have white cubes. There is no white cubes. Those are gray. I told you they're oh, gray. Oh, I'm sorry. You're right. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Um, I guess I'm going to take my turn now. Um, <laughs> yeah, go ahead, ready, games. If you can explain this to me, destroy, I don't know what this means. I'm going to destroy uh, a card from my action pool. I'm going to get rid of a wound again. And I guess I'm not moving. I'm going to play this. I'm going to draw a card. Nice. I'm going to play this out. So this charges one, and then I can draw two cards when I spend it. So it immediately is going to be full. But I choose when I'm going to actually use it, I guess. I have three combat. I'm just going to remember I have three combat. Okay. Remember, remember the combat green. December. <laughs> um, I have another one combat, another two money, but I think I'm going to do this to actually draw the two cards yeah, now. Yeah, because you might be able to punch the big guy, right? I might be able to punch the big guy. Oh, right. okay. So this means only if white is there, I can use it. Yes. Okay. Wow, I have a ton of money, All which would be right, great. So I'm if good I, at defending, no mm. but sucky at attacking? Why? Yeah. Three, four. Wow, that's kind of terrible, actually. That guy has six hit points. There's no yeah, way. Yeah, I, I know, but you can get the not a helping hand. Well, that guy's actually really good too. Yeah, he'll do two wounds to me, but I can prevent one of them with my green. Okay. So I only take one wound. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna do the not a helping hand. Because he gives you two hits too, or is that three? That's, that's three, two? two. Okay. Two damage. Yeah. I'm trying to build my deck to start right. doing damage. Really, all we have to do is get you one more so guy, one and more I can get wound. over there. Two more guys. Look at all this money. I thought you said four portals. Look at all this yeah, money I, I would have had. Two guys to get the portal. Man, why do you have to kill two guys to get a portal? Because we need two of those the tokens. The fact that I can't buy anything because all those bad guys gotcha. are there. You're right. We need to kill two more guys. Yeah, we need two more of the of the trophies. Unfortunately, uh, Roy put out another guy. Unless Roy draws a three, we're, we're toast. Toast. A three. There's a three. Oh, but I can't even hit that guy because I don't have the token for him. Why, why are you being so weak over there? Did Basil? we flip over a card, by the way? All these tokens are wasted. Did we flip over a bad card? No, no we didn't. Uh, the one that's closest to Roy moves three spaces towards him. Either one of those, whoever's got the decision. It, it has doesn't to matter. move to me? Okay, fine. Let's move C into him so I can I get to that space. Wound. No, we'll move the red one, actually, so it's farther away from you. This one? Yeah. Got it. Hmm. I, Done. Well, I can't fight anything. I can't buy anything. Uh-oh. So I'm not moving. I'm just going to stay where I am, draw another event. Hopefully it's not another jokes on you card. Oh. Uh, can you gather resources to try to, if something tries to attack you? I mean, I'm going to play this one. Oh, to start building it up. But I don't have anything else. I mean, I, I could go heal. Yeah. And that would actually put this in my deck. It doesn't seem like a good idea, but I'll do it anyway. So okay. Don't heal so I'll more, spend right? two to move down to the heal thing. Then I'll pay. Well, I only have the one. Yeah, get rid of that anyway. out of here. Don't put that back. So in that's this out of my deck. But I also played this one. Okay. All right, that's Seems my good. turn. And you're not doing the. You're not doing that. Okay. And no, then, no, no. Do you get to put that in your deck now? The healing thing. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, that's uh, good. That'll let you heal more, right? It lets me heal you guys, too. Oh, oh sweet. Nice. Uh, okay, so uh, bad guy A goes two space towards the nearest player. A comes um, on the board. I think this is A here. Unfortunately, Mike, one. that's going to hit you straight up. Wait, one. Yeah, two. two. Right. I go around it, Mike. Well, I mean, I don't know. I think I could probably punch it, actually. Punch one of them. Oh, if you could punch it and then do the portal... Then why are we even here? If Mike's gonna do all the work, I think. Well, but I, there's point, no portal to, to do, leave. right? We have to, we have to get. No, I meant, I meant on your next. Yeah. Turn. Oh, I wish. Um, okay, so let's move. Let's do this. I think my time holding down the big boss is done to because I can no longer. I'm not gonna be able to fight anything there at all. All right. Oh, these have to go away first of all. Oh, but then you're gonna have to fight the big boss. Well, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> 
I'm gonna <laughs> run far away. It's one, you guys' two. responsibility now. And then I can do this one for three. I am gonna get hit by that guy. Thank you, Guido. That's okay. All right, so I'm gonna spend these three. I'm gonna try to end on a blue space. Right. Or maybe I always end on a positive space. note. Huh? Uh, I'm gonna use maybe these I'll three, to, three to, to hit that space. succubus. Succubus is out. Okay, he's gonna hit me yeah. for one. Unless you have a blue. I don't. I could have. Well, no, I couldn't have. So that's fine. All right. I'd I'd one hit. more creature to kill, and we won the game. Well, then we got to steal the portal. Uh, and then these can't do anything for me, right? Because I had moved already and done a fight. Well, you would have used those before the fight. You would have gathered the resources from where you were at after oh. you moved. Oh. After you moved. So there's yellow there. So you have a couple yellows. Yeah, yeah. I don't know yellow. that those do anything. No, I mean, they Well, could... somebody might pop up here and attack right. him. Actually, Mike. Yeah, huh? Somebody might pop up and attack him. Yeah, okay. Potentially. All right, after Mike goes, B. Um, I think that's the one where I'm at. Yep, so nothing happens. Okay. Okay. What round are we on? Seven? We are around seven. Now the question is, what do I do? My hand three, is not going to let me do four, any five. damage. You can't fight? My problem is, is this shrooms thing has basically no, eliminated me from killing anyone. Oh, can you draw another one? It's eliminated me from killing anything. Unless there's someone that's ridiculously simple, which is not that. These I'm actually hoping something strings. pops up there so I can punch him, because I actually yeah, can do damage. I can actually do a fair amount of damage. I'm about to start. I haven't left the, ma the, the space the entire game, so I feel like I should get out there and do something. So I'm going to move two, two spaces? I'm going to have two spaces. I'm actually going to go... Yeah, because the problem is now he's going to start chasing people, and when he moves into your spot, he does hit you for... Should I just stay there? And I only have one coin. I'm just going to be sitting there. Yep. Put this down, and that puts a blue on it. Maybe I should just sit there and just sit there. Just I mean, I know there. it's not the most exciting. I can punch for one, which does nothing, so I'm not going to fight anything because I'd take a wound if I did. Um, so I just sit there. No, you have to fight something. If you're not doing an action, you have to fight. I'm buying something for one. No, you can't. You have to fight. Then yeah, I'm someone leaving. In your spot. All right. Then I have to leave. This. Yeah, but if you leave, you're going to take more damage that way. Because that big guy will follow you. Unless you run really far away. So then I fight one of the, the small guys and just take a wound into my deck? Yeah. <sighs> okay. Look, I know it's not ideal, but it's a... Done. Well, it's kind of co-op, actually, but... <laughs> right. Alrighty, unfortunately, hey, I'm not that? I'm not too far off from that. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to... At least I, I might be able to hit somebody. I'm spending back. two to actually might. move up into where might Roy is. Costs. So that Roy can get away. Okay. I can't fight anyone because I'm just... Because of my stupid okay. tripping on shrooms. Oh, but this allows Roy to get out of there. I suppose I could just fight for no reason... You have to. You just yeah, I have you to. Have to. You're right. I have to. So I'm putting a token on this card too. It's destroyed. But I'm just taking a wound. Although, uh, well, actually, let me see if you I can avoid it. it. You can. Pre is there anything there that has green? This is the only avoiding? thing that has one, and you have to fight that, and it only uses yeah, yeah, yellow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine, give me the wound. But you, your ability is you, your crazy thing means you can treat those as white, right? So you can use any cube for that. Oh, you're right. So I will do that. That gets rid of it. I don't take the wound in. Cool. All right, so we flip over a bad card. Bad card, move everyone one space towards the nearest player. Okay. Okay, does this okay. mean we both take damage or just one of us takes damage? Uh, I'll take the damage. Give me a wound. That actually is great for me because I can, I can knock him out. And then, can and then on the next turn, I can do the portal. Okay. If we make it that far. Uh, sure. we got uh, left. Yeah, 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 turn eight, uh, whatever. Yeah. We should be able to do it. We should be okay. All right. Okay. So it's my turn? It is. Oh, I ain't fighting next turn. I spend one. Well, I guess I am fighting. To go here. Mm -hmm. Right. That's, Beat him up. That's got a red spot. So Beat these, him like a these, rug. Those go away. So first thing, we'll do that to get one here. Yeah. Then we'll do this to get a red cube. All right. Then we'll do this to get another red cube. You're and the to man. heal, which I don't think, I, I think that's still in my deck deck. And then I do this to get two punches. Oh, wait. Oh, no. And a yellow. You're the man. Hit right. that boy. So I've got three. I can hit one of these fours. Yeah, yeah, and then I can block. So if I do that, something killed by lightning, yes. right, uh, I'd be able to block it because I'd be yeah, spending three. Yeah, but you can't three. kill it. You can't kill it. Why not? 
Oh, can, you don't have blue and green. Then I'm not. Then I'll kill. Then I'd rather kill. I mean, I don't mind taking hits because um, I've got things that can heal me. All right, so let's kill the dandy. I guess I'll get hit for two. One, two, three, four. Yep. Right, and then one Do of those cubes. Do you mind cube? if I no. take one of these cubes? That's here. the whole idea. Yep. This goes my deck. I'm going to be hit for two, which is okay because, like I said, I've got things that can that can heal here me. You go. All right, and then this will stay there. And then Margo? I'm on the, this goes away, and now my next turn. For now, it's going to come back right. and you. Oh, you know what? If it comes back again, though. I have to kill it before I can do that. Why don't you move, oh, you can't move up. <sighs> we could just lose by just I natural. I can move right here. No. Should I think you should. On there? No, I think, I think Mike should move off it, because if the enemy moves on the portal. That's more annoying. It will come that will move towards so you. you. stay here, mm -hmm. and then you just have to spend two cards to move there. No, just one card, right? Oh, yeah, just one. He doesn't need cards. If he gets this, he gets three movement. Yeah, that's fine. All right, so let's do that. Okay, that makes sense. And then, good call, good call, does this go call. into my deck? Yeah, you, get, you have to charge it. When you get it again, you, you charge, charge it, it again. again. Got it, okay. All righty. So, before Roy goes, I need to shuffle this and draw. Yeah, that way that thing comes back. It will, it will move towards you, but... Right. You don't want it to right. you don't just want sit, to on, sit that on that portal because then you got to fight it again. Right. Oh, wait. It says right now you can spawn the enemy on the orange portal. Oh. Oh, then stay on the portal. Yeah, then there's no reason to do that. Well, I'll still, I can still charge it. It doesn't hurt, right? Yeah. All I right. didn't realize we could spawn them from the orange one. C, one space or news play. Is that C? This is A. C so, is right there. All right. All right, Roy, what, what are you going to do? Can you beat up someone? Or are you going to run away and let me <laughs> handle these guys? I can try to fight somebody. I get to draw two cards with this. Well, if, you, know, if you can't, go ahead I, and run. I, no, no, I mean I'm almost at being able to beat somebody. And drawing cards will help me. But we win on, on next Yeah, but you turn, have to right? move now is what I'm saying. I'm not moving then. Okay. But we win on my next turn, um, correct? So I draw two cards. I would Theoretically, so. yeah. Oh, snap! That's not quite enough. Um, this lets me discard both these wounds, though, which is amazing. And that gives me a blue. Um, this went away. Um, oh, that's my discard pile. Um, and how much is the big guy? Does he Six. use? Six. Oh, he doesn't use blue to fight him. No, yellow and gray. I have one, two. Th I have six. Oh. But he hits me back for all of that. But he hits you back for a lot. I don't even care. No, I mean, might as well, because we're going to hopefully gonna win But I'm going to prevent one of it turn. with the blue. Right. I want to prevent one of it with this other blue. But that's going to get you a gravely wounded, right? Or no, it's only when you no, have them in your action No, it's only when they come out. Yeah. I guess they were right about it being four. hard to die in this yeah. scenario. I'll take four. One, two, three, four. But I killed the big guy. Boom. Woo! Boom. I he believe goes into that's your deck. a get him right? out of here. minor victory. Actually, it will matter probably for end of game. He lets game. me draw two cards. That's good. That is what I want. And we should also refill that. We have one more it's card. It's round nine. Out. Yep. And I figured that's closest to Roy moves three, and that's the same thing. Same there, okay. Okay, my turn. Uh, I'm just going to sit here and get whooped up on. I could run, though. You could run. You can run and do an event. Listen. Yeah, I, I want to do an event. <laughs> Tom, you just need to learn how to handle your shrooms. I've been um, using this magic I'm, shroom. Hang on, I'm not doing an event yet. All game to great Discard success. Discard a card. <laughs> oh, I'm healing Roy for two. Nice. Oh, wow. Okay. And then I get two resources, and what's here? Gray. So I get two grays. All right. I'll, well, gray, and I'll take up blue. All right. Come on, Mike. Give me a good event. This one better not be jokes on me again. Jokes on you? <laughs> you gotta pull off the glasses every time. I just want to make sure I get all of this right. Yet another demon. <gasps> you meet a demon. Great. Another one, you sigh, and hurt the demon's feelings. Tom. Ah, oh, so rude. You spend half the day apologizing and explaining that it's been a really long day. In the end, the demon smiles and introduces herself as Emily Bronte. What's Emily Bronte doing in the human hey underground? Hey, man, Emily Dickinson and Emily Bronte, we're instead chilling. Instead of Wuthering Heights, impossible to say, add a character card, Emily Bronte, to your deck. Oh, well, here's Emily Bronte. She happens to be right on top. How convenient was that? Okay, uh, I was just told by the designer Ooh. that we've been playing the game wrong. Okay. Uh, what part At the end of mean? every player's action, when, a when the player's in a space with a monster, be it a small one or a mini boss, you need to fight. I did. I thought yeah, that's what we we've did. been doing. Or the boss. 
We did or. I, we fought the bad guy each time. Yeah, I thought that's what we were doing too. So maybe maybe we're wrong. I thought we were fighting. Anyway, Emily I Bronte. Mean, sometimes we just took straight up damage. Yeah, I think we just took hits. There was, there was a turn where I couldn't hit, hurt it at all. But, but I, I just remember you saying you have to fight. If yeah. You're, right. So if, if, if we did that wrong, uh, then hopefully you folks will figure it out as time goes by. B goes one space towards the nearest player. Where's B? Um, It's where we're at. Okay. All right, so it's to me? Yep. All right, well, first of all, I've got these wounded cards. i got to stick here. Oh, wait, you left me. Yeah, but still, near. it doesn't come towards me. And this is nearest player, not current player. I thought I, thought I was going to Gather one resource. Friends, Red. hang out with me in the space here. Gather one in the start of space. anything. Let's make it blue. Money means nothing. Close that portal! <laughs> Mr. Garbagejaw! <laughs> Close down this portal! That's right. Okay, so it's very possible, folks, that we've made some mistakes going through this, and yes. maybe we didn't take damage when we did. But we're gonna we're gonna claim the win regardless. That's right. I took damage every. We, we took some damage. Uh, so now we're gonna actually see who the one true hero oh. is. Oh. So you get two points if you finish your hero class quest. That's also me. I did not. So we each have two, three points for each portal portal token we have on the walk in the street quest card. So, well, I guess that each of us got, who closed all, did you close all four I portals? I closed, if not all of them, three of them. No, I closed one, I think. Yeah, Roy couldn't have, because he was been I there. never so moved I, I believe I. All right, so that's nine points. Actually, I'm just, for the sake of things, I'll say you got them all, so 12. One point for each enemy of the crown in your deck. So it shows you the points in the bottom of the card. You can just count those. Right, your your big one's probably worth three. It is. So I got two. Also, your shop card that you bought is worth points. Okay. So just count up all the points in your deck. I should have one more shop card. So these are worth how much each? How much yep. are these worth? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. These are each just worth one? Yes. It shows you in the corner. corner right there. Oh, okay. So three there. So nine plus Roy, you got two, 11. And then minus one for each set of two status cards. Is that so every rooms? two status cards is minus one. Oh. So I end up with a total of four. So I think you got two. one of these, Tom. <laughs> I do. I think you got one of those. I might have closed okay, the portal. So I, three, I feel like four, I did. Five, you did. Six, seven. I had seven total. So nine, ten, eleven, twelve, minus one, eleven. I have seven. I also have seven. All right. Mike is the real hero. Whee! And Emily Dickinson and uh, Alice, Alice Wonderland fade off into the distance. All right, folks. This is going live in 33 minutes. Whoa. So you have a chance to see it there. <gasps> nice. We play through scenario one. The scenarios will have different map setups mm -hmm. and different cards will come out. Uh, like, for example, scenario two, the Bank of England heist. Oh. So we, there's a, a track. I thought those event cards were hilarious. Yeah. Oh, and that's actually, <laughs> that's actually made up of multiple chapters, too. Okay. Oh, nice. So there's three chapters to that one, too. We have to defeat Cerberus. Oh, the but dog. Isn't Cerberus the dog, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay. The Cerberus the cat's not in this particular well, scenario. Well, look, that's all right. I Listen, mean, he, he guards the gate we've of hell. Got, okay. We've got mystical poops and peeing on flower pots. Who that's knows true. Right? Joke's on me. <laughs> right. Tripping on trooms. All right. All right. Well, that's it for this, folks. This is the last live thing that we're doing here. I'll be live on Rado's channel later on at 2 o'clock mm -hmm. for a corner to corner. That's actually not too far away. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching. Until next time, I'm Tom Vassell. I am Mike Delicio. And I'm Roy Kennedy. Have fun tripping on shrooms. <laughs> no, don't do that. Don't no, do that. No, don't no, do that. Come on don't now. do that. <laughs>